One of the main requirements of the AAA paper is to ask candidates to evaluate significant audit risks arising from the scenario in the question. So what is audit risk? Let us do a quick revision on this concept of audit risk. Audit risk is the possibility of the auditors expressing an inappropriate opinion in the audit report. What causes audit risk? Two sources. Firstly, audit risk arises from the client company and the financial statements of the company being audited. Secondly, audit risk also arises from the procedures performed by the auditors. Audit risk that is related to the financial statements of the company is broken down into Inherent risk and control risk Inherent risk Inherent risk is the possibility that the financial statements may contain material misstatements and these are due to factors which are not related to the internal controls of the company it can be related to factors such as the nature of the client's business, its operations, and the types of business transactions that have taken place. Your client's business transactions could be complex in nature, and sometimes your client may need to use judgment to decide on an accounting estimate when preparing financial statements. Therefore, in such circumstances, material misstatements is likely to increase and therefore inherent risks will also increase. At times, changes in the business environment such as technological changes may also increase inherent risk. For example, the valuation of inventory could be a material misstatement. If inventory becomes obsolete, and this is not measured appropriately in the financial statements in accordance with accounting standards. Control risk. Control risk is the possibility that the financial statements may contain material misstatements. And this occurs when the company's internal control systems may not be in operation to prevent or correct such misstatements. For example, failure of IT controls over a company's website may cause sales figures to be omitted in the financial statements. Since inherent risk and control risk is related to the financial statements, auditors need to assess such risks by gathering information through the scenario provided in the exam question. Audit risk related to the auditor's work is known as detection risk. Detection risk occurs when auditor's procedures performed fails to identify material misstatements in the financial statements of the client. Hence, detection risk will increase. That is why planning stage is important for the auditors. Once auditors assess financial statements may be materially misstated, they need to determine or plan the appropriate audit procedures. And this is to keep detection risk low and to manage overall audit risk. Since part of the audit risk arises from the client company, it cannot be eliminated but can be reduced to an acceptable level. And this is done through lowering the detection risk mentioned earlier. If you want to know more, do watch my next video. Thank you.